gonna do the card reading. There's my cards. The Norman and the Tarot. Love is in the air today. It's starting to feel like fall and I'm getting all cozy and my cards are inspired to talk to you once again about your soulmate or partner. If you need a private reading, check the details in the uh, comments or whatever of the video. Otherwise, stay tuned, pick your card. You're going to pick the pile that most sits with you as your pile, your answer. And today's question, what does your soulmate, love interest, partner, person you're with, what do they need to feel happy? Okay, let's figure it out. Let's help them. Let's make them happy so you can be happy. It's all about the love. Okay, thanks so much for tuning in and watching. I hope you subscribe and I hope these videos resonate with you. But if they don't, don't worry. It just means this wasn't the one for you. You can always get a private reading or check out another video. Okay. Let's get down to business. Okay, peeps, here they are. So number one is the pumpkin, two, three, and four. So pumpkin, love, don't give up, and courage. Pick the one that sits with you as your reading. Let's go. Time stands for okay. number one. So what does your soulmate, your partner, the person you're in love with, what do they need to be happy? Okay, let's find out what it would take to make them happy. And if you need a private reading, look below for the details. You can go to my website and there's a few different options. And it will be fun to help you out. Oh, okay. Let's see what the cards are saying. What your soulmate or love interest needs to be happy is they need to Take some time to reflect, to really look back and enjoy the past, enjoy the lessons they've learned, be grateful. And what they need from you specifically is support, is the time, the space, and the support to do just that. They need to know how much you love them and that you're there for them. That's what they need right now in order to be happy. And let's see what Lenormand has to say. They need to remove all doubt they're alone you know your love and your commitment and they need to know that you're there for them no matter what as they take this time maybe they're going through something right now maybe they are feeling stress and they need you to help uh, put them at ease and be there for them okay you can do Number it, number twos. one. All right, let's see what your soulmate, partner, love interest needs to be happy. Let's get you helping them and get them feeling good, and cozy, and all about the love this fall, okay? Okay, all right there. So, a lot is coming at them. They need to feel supported and lifted they need to stop and see how they can be proactive instead of reactive. They need to put something to rest. It is the change of season, so a lot of people do feel like they need to put things to rest before winter sets in, and they're feeling a bit of a panic and a stress of that. So you can help by bringing a calmness and not adding more to their plate. Let's see what Lenormand thinks. They need a home that, okay, so what does Lenormand say? They need a good, strong foundation at home. They need a good, strong family life. They want to, you know, have a family and they want to, you know, have fun and have surprises and, you know, take on challenges together and bring about changes in life. And, you know, they like to... Yeah, keep it fun and really family based and there's a strength in that and they're, you know, they want to be healthy and happy and have fun. So that's great. That's a pretty great person. Okay, number three, let's see 
what your partner, whoa, love interest, soulmate needs to be happy. Oh, and they need, uh, let's see. Oh, by the way, you need a private reading. Check the description below. Okay. Okay. Right here. Okay. So they need to take some time to honor themselves. Um, do things that make them feel good, like spa treatments and things like that. And let them decide what it is that they need, you know, give them the space to do that. Let them um, tell you what, what it is they need for reflection. And just, you know, and don't be offended if they're setting some boundaries and it sounds like they're pushing you away. They're not. They just need a little time and there's nothing wrong with that. It's actually really great. When they take that time, it's better for the both of you. Okay, let's see what Lenormand has to say about that. They need you to help take care of them a bit and they need you to bring about a bit of luck in their life. Make them feel that sort of lucky, um, that lucky vibe. And you are going to do that for them. You're, yeah, you know, you've got that sort of mama bear mentality and that's bringing them hope and stability for the future. They take that luck and turn it into something for the two of you going forward. Um, and they want you on board with that and they want you building them up for that. So that's why they need to take time to reflect and they need you to give them that that space to do that. Eh. Cool. Okay, boys, let's get ready. Let's see what does your partner, your soulmate, your love need to be happy. What do they need to feel happy right now? Okay, let's see what the cards have to say. Number four. chariot upside down okay so this one's all about avoiding you know and misdirecting your attention to little things and maybe over worrying and obsessing about someone else and avoiding the true issue uh, with oneself so either you or um, your love interest could be doing that maybe you're doing that together avoiding the real problem so you're gonna have to face it head-on and you're gonna have to stop with all this little stuff and focus in on what is really important that is what is going to make you guys happy and if we just go ahead and ask Lenormand Lenormand says they need the resources they've been dreaming about, the obstacles, the challenges to come to fruition, and the dreams to be realized. So if the two of you are working on a small business or towards business, or um, they need the challenges to be overcome and the dreams to be realized, to be happy. So that is a perfect place to focus attention. And if you've been procrastinating or being distracted from the dream, then that's why you've been missing the boat. So these do work very well together and makes complete sense, right? Time to get that dream. It's, you know, stuff is, the challenges can be behind you. You can figure out what was in the way here and get this abundance um, that you've been dreaming for. Yay! So exciting. I'm so happy for you.